everyone, welcome to a brand new disc golf video. Today I've got the West High Discs Shield. I'm gonna be throwing it, reviewing it in this video. I've got it in the VIP plastic. It's three speed, three glide, zero turn, and one fade. It feels really, really, really good in the hand. I've been really searching for a nice overstable throwing putter. Right now I'm using a gold line gauntlet, but as I keep throwing that, I'm gonna be looking for something to eventually uh, replace that in the overstable slot. And I know I've thrown the shield a bit in the past and it's pretty overstable, so we're gonna be reviewing it in this video. Let's go ahead and get into it. All right guys, here is a little profile of the shield. You can see a little bit of dome to it. Nice, tall profile in the hand, really comfortable feel. Uh, it's not too deep, not too shallow. I really like how it feels in the hand. Uh, this VIP plastic is awesome and this color is great too. So we're gonna be throwing it on Heiser, Flat, and Anheuser, and we're gonna see how it flies. All right guys, I'm just gonna go ahead and throw this on some Heiser. Uh, we'll see how it flies. <laughs> really, really overstable. All right guys, so the shield was able to hold a pretty overstable hyzer. I'm gonna throw it flat. You should see the stability kick in and uh, this should be a good flight. It's gonna go flat, should go straight for a little bit and then fade. This thing has some serious overstability to it. I really put that with some good power, flat, maybe a little bit of Anheuser. It turned a little bit, but it barely wanted to turn over. It wanted to come out in Heiser again. So this is actually way more overstable than I thought. It does not really fly like a zero one. It flies more like a zero two. Um, so this is actually pretty overstable. I think this would be a good option for a lot of people looking for an overstable throwing putter and they may not really know how overstable the shield actually is. Um, yeah, I'm gonna throw it one more time and we'll see how far I can get it. All right, let's see how far we can get this thing. That thing is beefy, dude. That thing is really beefy. Uh, I'll measure that, we'll see how far it is. Man, that's definitely not gonna be as far as my normal putters, but that is a tool to have. I may consider uh, that as a future putter in my bag. We'll see how far that went. All right guys, well that is the shield. I threw it 300 feet exactly, um, which is not necessarily uh, too far compared to my normal putters. I've really practiced throwing putters, so I feel confident with the nose angle and stuff. If they're really so one of my go-to putters full power, I feel like 320 is around the range I go. So this actually wasn't too far off of 320. Um, the shield, really, really interesting. Uh, it was very overstable, way more overstable than I expected. It's definitely something that you consider. It's one of the most underrated, I guess, overstable putters. Um, and so I really enjoyed throwing it. I'm definitely considering uh, putting this in my bag, probably not in this plastic, probably like a soft plastic to have a really overstable throwing putter soft plastic so it doesn't give much ground action um but yeah i may consider adding like a soft shield to my bag definitely one of the one of a, re a really good throwing putter from west side here the availability is really good you can pretty much find a shield all the time in one of the bt plastics uh, which is baseline so thank you guys for watching this video if you're interested in picking up a shield i believe you can get one at dynamicdiscs.com uh, but yeah that's it for this video thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next one <laughs>